Hello YouTubers, Steve here. Um, gonna do a very quick uh, DVD update because I only got two uh, DVDs. Um, got a bunch of films I've been meaning to check out this week. Uh, some of which were I checked out yesterday, uh, the Wa the White Sheik, based on uh, R. Chataway 87's recommendation. Uh, love Federico Fellini, so I decided I'd uh, check that one out. I thought it was very good. Of course. It's always worth checking out some of Fellini's films. So, um, gonna check out *The Red Shoes* based on uh, Caitlin Zero Twenty's uh, recommendation, and I'm gonna check out uh, another film that I've been wanting to check out for a while now, uh, *Army of Shadows*. <laughs> uh, I've I've been meaning to check that one out for a while, so. Let's not waste any time and get right into this DVD update. Uh, I'm going to do it now because I, I don't know if there's going to be a Criterion update Friday. We'll, we'll just, we'll have to see. Um, I had ten bucks, extra ten bucks in my pocket today. So, I, I was feeling pretty good about myself. Uh, I was in a good mood, so I decided to stop by my Walmart, my local Walmart. Or as uh, B. West Jr. would say, my local Wally Mart um, and I was gonna put the 10 bucks towards my next uh, criterion where I had a few films in mind like uh, scenes from a marriage or the leopard both are uh, 50 bucks each so I came across th you know they had their five dollar DVD section and I was just amazed I mean, they had, like, the Maltese Falcon. I'm like, what? <laughs> uh, I, I paid full price for the Maltese Falcon. Of course, I do not own the uh, the cheap single-disc set. I own the three-disc set with uh, three different versions of the film. So it, it really didn't bother me that it was for so cheap. Meanwhile, I paid full price for it. But first one up is Samuel Fuller's The Big Red One. Uh, the reconstruction. I got this for five bucks at Walmart. Um, another YouTuber bought this. Uh, I wouldn't say recently, but over the past year or so, for full price. And I'm laughing as I'm paying five bucks for this. Um, he probably got the two disc set, and this is only a single disc. But I remember it really annoyed the hell out of me after uh, I paid like 26 bucks for a bullet. And even back then, after I bought it, I was really like, really mad at myself. I was like, why did I pay so much for this? I mean, I like the film, but I wouldn't pay it. I wouldn't do it again. And then it's been out for like five bucks and everywhere. I'm like, <laughs> I was. Uh, grinding my teeth whenever I saw that. But I decided to give it a chance. I've never seen the film before. Uh, I do enjoy Samuel Fuller's work. If you want to see a really weird film, go check out uh, Shock Corridor. <laughs> my god, that's great though. Uh, this next one is a double feature set. I've been meaning to pick these uh, two films up. But the price was never right. I've seen the set before, but I was, well, let me just show you first. And it's a fistful of dollars and a few for a few dollars more. I already own The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly. And I've been meaning to pick up these two films so I'd have uh, the whole entire trilogy. And I've seen this before for about 10 bucks, and I was looking to spend probably like 7 bucks for this. Uh, I was I, I didn't want to spend a lot, you know. I've I've seen it, like these two films, always with the good, the bad, and the ugly. And I I hate buying the same movie twice, and it was never at the uh, a right price, you know. I, the most I'd be ever willing to spend on this is like ten bucks, you know, for both films. And the price was right, so figure what the hell. I'll have to buy a cheaper Criterion in my next pickup. Uh, I've seen these two films before, obviously, but I've never seen the big red one before. And I'll have to watch that and give you my idea of uh, my views on that film. So, see you later.